Emmanuel Yinka, well, here we are in uh, central London. Right now we're in Russell Square and we're about to go and uh, meet your brand new lecturer at uh, UCL, University College London. So uh, I know that many of our viewers will want to know what's going through your mind uh, right now as you're about to commence your course. So can you just explain to us how has your journey been so far and how are you feeling right now? Um, my name is Yinka and this is Russell Square. We're just um, about to get to UCL and I'm so happy with the things I've seen around. It's a very cool environment to read, to study. It's a very conducive environment for studies and I'm so happy to be here. I would like to thank the man of God for this opportunity to study in this environment. It makes learning easy and I'm sure I would come away with brilliant results. Okay, what are some of the questions uh, that you're going to be asking your university lecturer when you meet him? Well, I'll be asking him to tell me a little bit about the course, how I can apply the course. But now I'd like to see the practical sides of what I'll be learning in class. So I'm really excited. I'm looking forward to the practical sides. How do you plan to make sure that you succeed and uh, come out to be exactly what God wants you to be uh, when you finish this master's? Okay, well, I know I have a role to play, so I would play my own role and at the same time, so I would find out God's opinion about my situation, then I will play my own part, so I would come out with good success then. Okay, can you tell us how has your time at the Synagogue Church of All Nations and uh, the wisdom, the knowledge, the understanding that uh, the man of God, Prophet T.B. Joshua, has imparted uh, into your life going to actually affect the way that you live as a student here in London? Ah, well, I really thank God for um, knowing the man of God, for him being my father, because it's really going to change my life. I'm going to live as um, a student with a difference. And the man of God, as the man of God taught me, the first place to prosper is in my spiritual life. So after that, every other thing then follows. And it says I should read as if it all depends on me, and also pray as if it all depends on God. So I would combine that, my hard work with God's good grace. Hallelujah. Well, we're very, very happy to hear that uh, you know the principle that uh, we must prosper first in our spiritual life. And we also encourage you and remind you to choose your friends with care. Okay, Every relationship in our life uh, benefits us either positively or negatively. Remember that there are those that add and multiply your life, and there are also those who subtract and that divide. So choose your friend with care and make sure that you involve Jesus Christ in your decision making. So right now, let's go. Let's go and meet your, your university lecturer. And I believe that uh, all the Emmanuel TV viewers will follow us. Yes, we should go to UCL now to meet my new lecturer and also to see the, um, the environment where I'll be studying. Viewers, you should continue in, in this trip with us, okay? Thank you. A few minutes down the street lies the three major sites of the impressive University College London. Established in 1836, the University of London is split into several campuses. To find the electronic and electrical engineering department buildings and set off confidently in the right direction. Hello, this is Inka, and now I'm in University College London. The building over there, which is a new one, is a department for electrical, electronics, engineering, and that is where I'll be having my lectures. Today is my first day in University College London, and from what the man of God um, educated me about, um, it's a challenge. It's not a choice, it's a challenge to my faith in God. And once again, I would like to thank Emmanuel TV for their prayers, for their support, and for the privilege to be in one of the best universities here. So, um, as I promised, I promised to come up with a brilliant result with the help of Emmanuel TV, their prayers and their support. Inka moves around the campus, familiarizing herself with her surroundings. She arrives at the Department of Electronic and Electrical Engineering on the sixth floor of the UCL Engineering Building. Moving through the department, she walks past one of the practical laboratories to the office of her course supervisor. This is Dr. Ben Thompson, the Supervisor for Technologies for Broadband Communications courses at the University College London. In this initial meeting, Yinka has the opportunity to ask those important questions concerning her course while Dr. Thompson outlines her study topics, which she will commence in earnest 
as of tomorrow. Hi, I'm Dr Ben Thompson. I'm a lecturer here at UCL and I'm also responsible for the MSc program that Yinker is doing with us at UCL this year. Um, so far she seems to have settled in fairly well, what I'm saying. I think she seems to be enjoying the lectures as far as I can tell. So um, I think hopefully she should do well. A few weeks later, the Synagogue Church of All Nations team have come to pay Yinka a visit. Emmanuel, this is Rachel and Catherine. We're here today in London. We're visiting Yinka. Uh, as you followed us all the way from Lagos to here in London, UK. Uh, right now we want to knock on her door and see if she's in. This is where she's staying with other scholars during her study at UCL. So please follow us and let's see how she's doing. Yinka welcomes the team into her apartment and, after the warm welcome, gives them a tour of where she is staying. Taking them first to the combined kitchen and living room area, then upstairs to her bedroom. So you're yeah, welcome. Um, this is my bedroom. We are actually three here. Yeah. We are three scholars. Um, but today is Saturday, so they are not around. They've gone for shopping and some other things. So I'm taking time at home to study. And so this is my book. The book um, the school gave to me when I resumed. Um, it's an um, introduction to telecommunications network where they give us a brief summary of um, what telecommunications networks are all about so even if you're not familiar with them you can have a brief understanding of what the course is about this is a laptop i used to study and um, it was gotten with the help of emmanuel tv viewers so viewers um i just want to say a big thank you for the purchase of this laptop without the laptop i can't actually study because everything here it is has to do with computers so i'm happy and i'm grateful for the purchase of this laptop to assist in her education yinka needs access to the internet at home to enable her to carry out research as part of her studies and of course yinka will need to touch up on her cooking skills as she gets used to some new foods here, Yinka fries her first traditional full English breakfast. With the bacon already sizzling away in the pan, she cuts some sausages to join it. This is Ruth reporting for Emmanuel TV right here in the heart of London. This has been the city where Yinka has spent her year doing her master's degree at University College London, uh, currently the seventh best ranking university in the entire world. She has studied a master's in broadband communications and now she has finished her master's degree, handed in her final dissertation and the Emmanuel TV team have visited her to find out just how she feels now that that time has come in her life. The scholarship was given to her by Prophet TV Joshua and Emmanuel TV partners and she's so grateful for the opportunity that has been given her to study in the city of her dreams. Thank you. Hello everyone, um, my name is Inka and I'm here standing outside um, University College London where I've been studying for a year. I've been studying my master's in broadband communications because of the scholarship given to me by Prophet Sibi Joshua and Emmanuel TV partners. University College London is located um, in central London and I'm standing in um, the main um, campus um, of University College London and in front of me is the main entrance. And as you can see, it's a beautiful environment here in University College London. Um, it's a peaceful environment, it's um, quiet, it's a place where you can learn and then um, acquire knowledge which I hope to take back with me to Nigeria to help develop the communications industry. And also, I would also like to be um, a help to others because I have received help. Um, and as a man of God says, the primary reason for asking for blessings should be to bless others. So, um, because without scholarship schemes, it won't be possible to um, achieve dreams and aspirations. And um, dreams would just die just because of um, lack of opportunities. So I pray one day to also be a help to 
people like me so I could help sponsor and help them achieve their dreams and aspirations just as Emmanuel TV has helped me achieve my today. So viewers, I just want to say thank you for your prayers and support. Hello, my name is Simon Chandler. I'm studying philosophy at MA level and so far my experiences of, of it have been really good. Uh, the, the lecturers are really helpful and, and informative. They really have a passion which they communicate to us and um, which they impart to us. And um, since um, starting my MA, I've, my um, interest in philosophy has only increased and I've, I felt that I've, felt as I've been, um, I received a greater kind of grounding and, and, and um, familiarity with material. I feel better able to articulate um, what have been intuitions at just a kind of common sense level. I've been able to articulate them into a more kind of um, rigorous and um, terminologically um, detailed account of uh, philosophical subject matter. So yeah, I would really recommend coming to London. Um, um, goes without saying, the place is very uh, is a, a very rich place to um, be studying in. Although obviously it is quite expensive, but apart from that, it is um, a great place to study, and I would recommend it. So yeah. Sorry, my name is Nariksha. So I'm studying pharmacology at UCL. Um, it's a really good course, really good department. Um, the tutors here are really good. I'd it's like it's a really large department, though, like, but um, the classes are quite one-to-one, -one, so you get a lot of help. We would definitely recommend it to other people. My name is Jeffrey Elliott. I'm from Connecticut originally. Um, my experience here so far has been awesome. Um, I am in two philosophy classes, Marxism and philosophy of the mind, along with an anthropology class and an archaeological class. And all of them have been very different experiences, but very, very good experiences. The lectures are very different for me from my home school because usually they're much smaller classes back home, but um, they've been very engaging even though there's many more students and the professors are all very, very interested in like student learning, um, which I obviously really appreciate as being a student and definitely recommend it. I have already recommended it to all of my friends back home to come here. Um, great location, like awesome. I mean, London is just an amazing place, so definitely place that I would say come to UCL but Bye -bye, Ioannou. I'm from Cyprus. Uh, I'm doing biomedical sciences at UCL. Um, I chose UCL because it's one of the best uh, universities in London and, and in UK generally. And um, my course is uh, perfect for me. I chose it because it suits me and uh, I would definitely recommend it because um, it's fun and enjoyable. Hello, this is Ruth reporting for Emmanuel TV and Yinka has now finished her master's course at UCL University College London. Emmanuel TV has been following her throughout her scholarship, but she's been here one year studying her master's and we've come to visit her now. She's handed in her final dissertation and she's finished her master's degree. So we've come to celebrate with her and to find out what it was like during her year here at UCL in London. So right now we're on one of the major tourist attractions in London, which is called the London Eye. It's a big wheel that goes all the way round and from it you can see all around London. So take a look. Stay blessed. This is Ruth reporting for Emmanuel TV.